But now that we're almost a full quarter into the new calendar, I know, right? Now that we're at that point, what do you think the other nine months of this year hold for those of us that that dwell in the collective insanity? You know, it's interesting. I've been thinking in my head, trying to remember the patterns, what you laid out i think pretty eloquently i have the clip here you said i expect 2024 is going to be like nothing we've seen so far the pattern that has been established since january 1st 2020 is that as the propaganda campaign continues to roll out it has to get bigger more absurd more spectacular has to continually wow you with its level of absurdity take 2016 take 2020 even 2000 and roll those up together in a big old fat spliff and that's what we're going to get in 2024 pedal to the metal and if i had a number of guests on um, echo that same sentiment. You know, I had on Curtis Stone, the urban farmer. He pretty much. Well, I am a trendsetter. Came, yeah, yeah. And so, or, you know, Curtis Stone. I had on a guy called Brandon Weikart. Um, last week he echoed the same sentiment. Jeremy Ryan Slate, who I've interviewed, pretty much said the same thing. And it's just like everyone's coming to that same conclusion. I, I forget who I was talking to recently who was saying to the tune. This is the thing, because I don't even know in time and space where I am anymore, 